Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to another stream. This is the Count of Monte Visto, and today I got something a little bit special for us. Although I don't think we'll get too many people uh, viewing this because I think it, like it only has like 200 followers on Twitch. In fact, maybe I should just change this right now to like games and demos with the rest of the foreigners. I don't know. Ah, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll just fucking do that. So, what is this game? What is Footsies? Why is there Quentin Tarantino in here? What does this have to do with feet and foot fetishes, as we can see in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen? Well, this game is a budget indie title that was released for Steam, I don't know, maybe like a year or two ago. And the whole idea is that it's a minimalist indie fighting game that is very, very, very dumbed down to the point where you can't jump and you only have one attack button. <laughs> so, so the whole idea is, is you strip down the fighting game to its bare minimum components in order to help drill fundamentals like spacing, uh, baiting your opponent with punishing, that kind of shit. Hit confirms, all that good stuff. So it's a way to, you know, kind of help you for, you know, very small price, help you with... Uh, just fighting game. So I picked this up for, I think like four bucks is what it is full price. Um, right now it's on sale for two or three bucks. I kind of forget what. But um, yeah, I think it's a really good idea. It kind of reminds me, there's a game called Kovac. K-O-V-A-A-K. Uh, track Trainer, which is just for um, like tracking targets and to get you better at first person shooters. So it's along that, that same light. But I, I hear this game is pretty hard. It's... Um, a very niche title. It's only really popular with uh, people who are into fighting games, unfortunately. But let's check it out because I want to get more into fighting games. I want to get better at fighting games. My my, like I understand that fighting games as a genre is very inaccessible because of how uh, intimidating it is. If you join me for my Street Fighter 2 streams, you know that I get my fucking ass handed to me, and I get very salty, which I I feel like it's almost impossible not to. And I have seen some videos that kind of confirm that the uh, AI in those old Street Fighter games cheat. You know, you'll have Guile walking towards you and then do a flash kick, which is impossible. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, let's dive into this shit. Right now, we're listening to some uh, some Kirby, Dreamland 3, the uh, gourmet race. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, let's dive into this. Let's see what this game is all about. Hopefully, we have ourselves a good time. Right now it is a Steam sale, so if you're watching this uh, within the next few days, this game being new, make sure to pick up some uh, games on Steam. I guess I should turn this up, huh? Yeah, let's uh, let's turn this up real quick. It's always it's always just such a gamble, and and most games when it's like this, it it's blasting your fucking ears. This is crazy. That it's this not ear damaging they actually do a good job balancing i mean obviously a game like this has been made by people who play a lot of games online so i'm sure they've also had their eardrums destroyed by splash screens when you launch a game for the first time anyway so you have uh versus a player you know couch play it's pretty cool for cpu if you just want to fight a cpu you have the arcade mode which i hear is uh I hear this is disgusting. I've done a little bit of research on this game. I mean, obviously, the fact that the fact that I even know about this game denotes that I <laughs> did some research on it, because not a lot of people know about this. You have online versus. Maybe we'll try that a little bit. Get bodied. <laughs> I fully expect to get bodied anytime I play an online game that's fighting. Uh, training mode, customize options. So let's do well. Uh, let's do some training mode. We'll uh, try customization a little bit later. Um. Yeah, I guess I guess we could do free training, but uh, let's just jump in the tutorial. I feel like that was a little loud. Welcome to the Footsie's tutorial. This tutorial will teach you the basics of the game. Teach you the basic of this game. Maybe it's supposed to be <laughs> a fucking typo. Footsie's is a very simple fighting game, so this won't take long to finish. Please read the following instructions. Start with the movement. Left and right buttons to get close or away from your opponent. Move forward. Press the right button to move forward. Yep. Yay. Good. Move backward. Press the left button to move backward. There we go. Very simple. Very simple. If 
I've never like I like I like games that have good tutorials. It's one of the reasons why I preach about uh, Guilty Gear so much. Also, I picked up St uh, Skullgirls recently. I hear that's uh, really really good, and I played a little bit yesterday just to see what it was like. And yeah, that is a cool tutorial. Let's learn how to attack. There are two types: of normal attacks, kick, attack, and knee attack. Kick attack. Press the attack button to perform kick attack. So yeah, it's just one single attack button. Maybe I should turn this down. The attack, you move forward. Good. Yeah, in fact, let me, uh, let me, uh, shit, turn this down. When we get back to the main menu, the difference between these two attacks is that kick goes further, while knee comes out faster. Knee is faster, kick is further, got it. But you cannot KO your opponent with just a kick or a knee, you need to land a special attack to KO the opponent. One way to perform a special attack is to press the attack one more time after a normal attack can contacts the opponent. Okay. Let's hit the button again. Move to the opponent and press the attack button two times. Just like that. Nice. There are three methods to perform a special attack. One is the consecutive attack as explained earlier. The second method is to hold the attack button for one second then release. Called a raw. I like. I like how it says what it is in the background. Hold the attack for one button. Perform the back kick. Do not move while releasing the button. There we go. Just like that. And I did fuck around a little bit just to see if <laughs> see if this would run right. Right. <laughs> see if this would run properly. But you can turn on uh, in free training hitboxes, which help kind of help you visualize. Uh, the third method is to hold the attack button for one second, then release it while moving. All right, let's just show it to you, Ken. Got it. Nice. That's it for the offense. Let's look at the defense next. You can defend the opponent's attacks by blocking. Move backwards to block the opponent attack. There we go. Guess you automatically duck. That's cool. Blocking is very powerful, but you cannot block forever. Keep blocking the opponent attack. When your three shields run out, oh, that's what the shields are, okay. Any attacks from the opponent will cause a guard break. On this state, getting attacked by consecutive attack is guaranteed KO. Avoid the situation at all costs. And that's all the necessary rules you need to know to play this game. There are more technical knowledge, but it's better to learn those in a real match. Try playing versus CPU or players to learn the winning pattern from them. And don't forget to try hit confirm and punish mini game to improve your skills. Good luck. So that is, hey, we got an achievement. Look at that. So fancy. Uh, we'll, we'll turn, <laughs> turn this down real quick. Woo! Let's uh, turn that down to like 65. Those beeps and boops can get a little bit, a little bit shrill. There we are. So that's the uh, training. I guess we could uh, check out customize. Can get do rag. Have a crown. Like like our boy Dirtle, our homie, should be in the recommended. Yeah, I like I like the do rag. Yeah, just the default. Okay, that's fine. And you can uh, actually change. I think the X's are transparent layers. That would make sense. Um, should we do like whip flash a little bit or to the guy? Yeah, but let's. let's I I feel like we need to try a little bit of this, huh? Attack the opponent and confirm whether it's hit or blocked. Press the attack one more time, only on hit. Oh, come on. Oh, fucking. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh, my God. <laughs> Shit, that sounds like the kind of tricky, huh? All right, come on. God damn it! Fuck it. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's. No, no, no. Rematch. I wanna. I wanna confirm that. They call that like poking or prodding, some shit like that. Oh my god, it's so hard. <laughs> my fucking. My fucking. Uh. My fucking reaction time is so balls. 
All right, well, this is actually good practice, though, to be sure. Hey, there we are. A little bit late in the frame in the top left. This, uh, yeah, really dubs it down for you. Fuck. Oh man. We, we won one. We won one. Hit cancel average. 23 frames. Alright, let's see one more. Oh god damn. <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> I gotta be 100% there. Fuck. You know this reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of the uh, that like Kirby mini game on the uh, NES. With like the quick draw. It's vaguely similar. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. God damn. Hold up, we can get this. I just need to. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck, I, I can't just guess. I have to actually, like, react to when it hits. And that's hard. <laughs> that's hard to do. Oh, God. Damn. I mean, I, I did it once, but it was, like, 20... Like, pretty much the last frame we could. Hey, there we are. 17. Not bad. Okay. There we are, 15 frames, okay. Fuck. Aw, oh, man. Shit, shit, shit. So close. Alright, we gotta do, <laughs> we gotta do one more. I mean, this is a game, really. Uh, obviously, there's online, and there's a, an arcade mode, don't get me wrong, but it's really, like... Meant to get you good at all this shit. Shit. God damn. It's like baiting me. Baiting me. Jesus. Jesus. My reaction time is so fucking bad. My reaction time is so bad. I, I like beat Punch Out back in the day. I swear, I, I keep bringing this shit up. Uh, I streamed Punch Out recently and I got my ass destroyed by it. But it's just, um... Yeah, it's crazy. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it, no, we had to keep going. Alright, then we'll, we'll switch to, uh, with Funish. How, how, how's my reaction that bad? My reaction is so fucking bad. My reaction is terrible. So fucking bad. Hey, there we are, we got one. Alright, alright. Oh, well, you can low kick like uh, that, right? Benny's kind of far away. Yeah, so there's only one uh, one attack button in this one, Nevi. Hold up. Oh, god damn it. I think, I think going with the knees is a little bit better. Because it's fast. Fuck. Damn it, damn it, my reaction is so fucking bad. Okay, one more time. One more time, then we'll switch to uh, the next mode. Damn it. 22 frames? I feel like, I feel like the frame uh, is different sometimes. Fuck. Sometimes it gives me like 25, sometimes not. There we go. Hey, got one. Fuck. See, see, I get, I get, I get all uptight. So, Nevi, what you want to do here is you want to hit confirm, right? So, you kind of want to poke and prod and see if he's blocking. And if he doesn't block, then you have to follow it up. But you have a very, very, very limited time. Fuck. Well, I don't know. I don't know how much you know about this, Nevi. Shit. Shit. Well, not necessarily frame perfect. You get a couple of frames, but my reaction time is so fucking bad. So fucking bad. So fucking bad. <laughs> Terrible. Jesus. 
Yeah, I was just saying uh, earlier, it kind of reminds me of those, like, the Kirby minigames in, like, Adventure, the uh, Quick Draw, and the Samurai Showdown. Hold up. Hey, there we are, that's one, 16 frame. You gotta, like, be really mentally there. You gotta be mentally right there. And not just fucking up and trying to jump the gun. All right, let's, uh, let's try the next one. That, that one's hard. We'll do uh, with punish. Our high score is two. Wait for an opponent to perform an attack and then attack back. Press the attack button two times to KO the opponent. Ah. So I can't move. Wow! <laughs> you have very fucking little time here. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> oh man, that's crazy. That's fucking dirty. Jesus. Jesus. That's cr that is fucking insane. Oh no, I'm trash at fighting games, Debbie, but this is known for being like really like legit hard. I was watching some compilations of this uh, game and there's some... See, I feel like that's a pretty good reaction time overall, but uh, clearly not good enough. Hey, there we are. Oh wait, press attack one more time. Oh, I gotta do a fucking confirm too. Oh shit. Damn it! Frame 19, holy shit. It's a hard one. I... I did hit it! <laughs> Wait, we'll, we'll do like one more, then we'll switch to arcade mode. This is fucking hard. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> One fucking frame off! Holy shit! Split fucking hair. Damn it! Damn! <laughs> fucking jigging me. This would be a fun uh, tactic to use. Yeah. Just have a seizure. Just keep going until they fuck up. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. Oh, I got you, Nevi. I appreciate you dropping it. Damn it! Ah, it's the fact that's like 18. And I need 17 in order to that. That just fucking drives me nuts. Mm, 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 mm. I will switch for this one. Jesus, yo, that is some insane reaction time you need. All right, we'll uh, hop on to um, arcade mode. There we go. All right, so we, we're up against Spammer. Hey, there we are. Okay. Let's stop them, huh? Okay, okay. You know what? Not bad. Not bad. Okay, cool. We just fucking ate the first guy. Now we're up against Blocker. Cock knocker over here. Oh, <laughs> wait, yeah, blocker, yes. <laughs> Don't go all in on blocker, huh? Oh my god, yes, okay, don't do a follow-up, yes. That is what the whole point of the training was. <laughs> I now see the error of my ways. 
Ah, okay, okay, I got it, I got it. There we go! Look at that! Alright, I'm understanding this shit now. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. I'm picking it up. Now we're, uh, again <laughs> we're up against Ordinary Guy. Damn, I'm surprised I got to round three already. I thought, like, we were gonna, like, embarrass myself, but no. I just rolled that guy, huh? Ooh. Yeah, that's, that's a punish. Okay. I feel like doing a charge is kind of, uh... Oh, you fuck. Damn. Got it, got it, okay. Match point, dude. Nice. Nice. Dude, we're killing it. Whiff Punisher, oh god, alright. So, I guess don't whiff, I don't know. Okay. Man, I guess the mini games are just hard. Oh god. The mini games are just harder than the arcade mode. Holy shit. There we go. Alright, alright. Oh, <laughs> what a dickhead. Alright, alright. Damn! Kicking the shit out of me, yeah. I guess so. We got some hit confirm, punish normal, I got you. Okay, okay. Damn, 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 damn. You try, like, blocking more, huh? <laughs> yeah, let's try blocking, yes, that's exactly what I did. Damn! Motherfucker, dude. Alright, I guess rematch. Oh, boy. Whiff Punisher is punishing my whiffs. There we go. Oh shit, you can dash forward. I didn't even fucking know that. Damn, dude. Damn. Alright, let's keep this up. Let's keep this up. Damn. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Oh, God. All right, all right. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Fuck. You don't want to be within range of them, but you do at the same time. Won't be just barely out of range, right? You wanna do that footsie shit. But not so close. Wow, that was too close. It did not look like I was too close. There we go. Is that for a fucking whiff punish, motherfucker? What the fuck did I just do? What the fuck was that? That's how you know I was spamming. <laughs> That's how you know I was just button mashing. Ooh, fuck. 
Alright, so I can be kind of, like, aggressive with, uh, my spacing. Seems. And they'll, like, kind of back up. Fuck! Did he kick my hat off? I didn't even notice that earlier. Fuck, man. Alright. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. Oh man, we gotta keep it up though. Give me the Street Fighter 2 vibes now. <laughs> Spending like, what was it, like two hours on M Bison? Wow. Hmm. Well, shit. There we are. How about that? How about that, motherfucker? Oh, god damn it. Oh, Jesus Christ. So you cannot go from a block to a hit. <laughs> damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. Wasn't fucking close enough. Jesus Christ. They can't be that close to him. I kind of need to be that close to him at the same time. Wow. Wow, that's horseshit. <laughs> that's a lot of horseshit, bro. There we go. Now that's not horseshit. It's not horseshit when I win. <laughs> yeah, good. Shit. Whew. <laughs> that was a fucking stressful round. Holy shit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, look at that shit. Look at that shit. One hit man. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't. Oh, okay. So you only did specials? Is that what I'm getting at? Oh, okay, okay. So this guy only does specials. Got it. Well, that means... Ideally, I might be able to block it. But yeah, that's a... You don't get a whole lot of time to react to... Oh, Jesus. Wow. So I'm assuming you just got a block, but damn. Or make him whiff. That, that is, that's horseshit. Maybe like dash forward, I don't know. It's like... Alright, dashing forward does not work. <laughs> dashing forward, wow, what a fucking gun. There we go. Okay. So you can reach. Fuck. You just gotta be able to block it, but man, time to block. Damn it! Gotta do like a normal fucking hit after a block. Shit. 
I was blocking, and then I, like, stopped holding back the fucking frame. He hit me, which sucks. <laughs> I can just lure myself in the corner. I feel like that's a horrid strategy, IRL. Well, IRL, in, in video games. Video games are real life now. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, come on, you fucking dick. What the fuck is that? I don't know what that is. Damn, damn, you get some insane reach with that. Can I fight fire with fire? Nope. Fighting fire with fire is not good. This is not a Metallica song. There we go. Okay, okay. I just need to reliably do that. Uh, reliably. <laughs> Fuck. That's hard. That's hard to do. I mean, that's what you do, though. You, you block and then you, uh, go in. The second I dash forward, he, uh, does an uppercut. That's crazy. You have very little time to react with that. Like, I can do it, just not regularly, you know? Ah, uh, that's, that's fucking, that's horseshit. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just cheese us. We'll just go in the corner. <laughs> we'll go in the corner. Wow, he is fucking fast. Can you charge it while you're waiting? You can. But then he wins. Why does he win? Why does he win? <laughs> it's like he knows when I'm gonna do it. How is he? F oh, it's like he's faster than me. I don't know. Yeah, that's a bad strategy. I don't know. I feel like it could work. I just had to react a little bit faster. The second I'm releasing, he's already at me. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, fine. Fine, we block it now. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know, I know you want to. I know you want to. I know you want to, motherfucker. Come on. Uh, 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 what am I doing? I'm not even blocking. Oh. There we go. Hey. <laughs> oh, man, I feel deep doing it that way, but I feel like it's the way the game wants me to do it. It's like I released the second that he... I released the block the second he releases for his attack. Oh, that hurts. That hurts a lot. Holy shit. Oh, man. I just, just do it this way. Just do it this way. Feels dirty, but it's the way I gotta do it. I, mm, uh, mm, I, I fucking, I, I did hit. I did, I did hit after my block. Uh. There we go. All right, all right. Match point, match point. We gotta make this count. Just like that scene in the Titanic. Oh, what, what, what did I just do? Okay, was that good? <laughs> Are you winning, son? I don't know. Rollbacker. What the fuck that means? Whoa. What is this? Oof. 
don't know what that means. Is that like, that's just some sort of fighting term I'm unaware of. Damn. All right, I gotta remember what I learned about hit confirms. There we are. Hey, that's something. I think this is more of like a guy where you learn, you use all that you learn. Like how not to do that. Holy shit. <laughs> oh man. Alright. That that sucks. I don't even understand that insta kill attack. Maybe it's like only works on match point. I had a chance, and I just didn't react fast enough. There we go, okay. That looked good. I feel like that looked good, that felt good. Ha 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 ha, that's nice. Spacing, spacing is good. There we go. I... Mm. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I don't like that shit. Well, I like it when I win. <laughs> when I win, it feels good. What the fuck happened there? Alright, that was cool. That was cool, that was clean. I like that. I like it. That was... Oh, man. Oh, God, that sucks. That did not suck. That was cool. <laughs> Alright, hey, look, I got a game clear. I, I, I beat it. 20 continues, 11 minutes. Secret attack command. Attack, attack, forward, attack, attack. Attack, attack, forward, attack, attack. Alright. Attack, attack, forward, attack, attack. Well, let's uh, see about that then. Um, we can do that and help our eyes. Let's, let's try this one for a little bit. Just burn our eyes a little bit. Just burn it. Just burn my eyes. Alright, training. Attack, attack. Attack, attack. Forward, attack, attack. Is that what I did? I don't even know. Is that what I did? I, I don't, I have no fucking idea. I don't even fucking know. Attack, attack, forward, attack, attack. I don't know what the fuck that means. Like, I mean, I know what it means, but, like, it's not... It does not seem to work. I don't even know. Alright, let's, uh... Yeah, so you can turn on the hitbox frame advance? I don't know what that means. Uh, input... Well, actually, that would actually help a lot. A lot of fighting games actually do this now, which I think is fucking awesome. I think for shit like uh, Street Fighter 2, they had to do like computer tools to do that shit. So you want to be, ideally, if you've never seen a fighting game thing before, 
You want to be right where your hitbox is overlapping to their shit. So it's like... I was watching one video and the guy compared it to that like first boss in the dungeon in uh, Link to the Past. The guy with the morning star. He kind of wants to stay out of his thing, then when he misses and his morning star retracts and you move in and kill him. That's like the same idea that you seen a million times before in other places, but uh, done again, done right. That's cool, that's cool that I, uh, that I fucking cleared that, so... Am I, am I MLG Pro now? <laughs> Should I get bodied for a little bit? Yeah, this is like, much better. God, it's gonna take a little bit for my eyes to adjust to this. So if I go to CPU, like, what is it? Okay, so there's survival and arcade survival. So there's a couple different modes here, actually. So right now I control both. Oh god, my ears. Oh yeah, that peaks, that peaks, motherfucker. That's cool. So in versus CPU, there's a couple extra modes as well. So once again, it's like, you know, it's an indie game. It's a low budget game, but it does give you a couple different things. So let's do... <laughs> we'll be, we'll be Will more Larry. Alright, let's see. Let's see if I, uh... <laughs> did I just make a uh, fucking... I did a quick match, yeah? Uh, some dude, huh? Definitely never heard of this one before. Yeah, I'm kind of trash at uh, fighting games, so I kind of like... It's one of the reasons why I like uh, Guilty Gear, is because the training mode is very... Very friendly. But, um... I guess we'll leave lobby. We'll, we'll come back to that for a little bit. So, uh, for like, training mode, right? You have hit confirm minigame, which I suck at. It's only one, one attack button, and that's all you get. So, so that I was way too slow, which is uh, understandable, because <laughs> I'm not good. Fuck, you gotta be real quick with that hit confirm. But the mini games they make it extra hard, like harder than the arcade version I've noticed. But um, that's difficult I find. Whiff punish. Fuck. <laughs> so yeah, shit like that. You want to hit them right when they uh, whiff. There we go. Just like that. So the single single hit only takes down one of their shields at the top right. So you need to do a confirm. Can't just poke. <laughs> but yeah, they make they make these mini games extra uh, extra shitty, extra difficult. Um, let's see. Uh, Guilty Gear is one of the harder games to grasp, but easily the best training mode. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I like about it. It's like it's really deep, but for newcomers, it's like, hey, this is how fighting games work. <laughs> Because, man, it, it is it is an intimidating genre, man, when, uh... Because, like, the people who are into it are good, and the people who aren't into it just don't play at all, you know what I mean? <laughs> so it's, it's like a genre where there's no real um, middle ground, I find. Um, let's see, so let's uh, try online again. Or I'll show you, I'll show you briefly, uh... We, we just did it, but um, I'll show you arcade real quick. So like spammer. <laughs> so I think it's uh, what five five opponents. There's spammer, blocker, with punisher. So they just tell you what they're gonna do. This guy just goes ape shit. <laughs> but he goes ape shit and will kick your ass. Honestly, let's uh let's turn off hitboxes. I feel like it's kind of distracting me a little bit. And also input. There we are. Spammer's pretty easy. You just gotta keep your distance a little bit, because no shit, he's fucking spamming. But yeah, it's it's uh, definitely a cool idea. The guy gets Drive, uh, though, used to play a ton of Red 2. Say like Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Yeah, I wanted, I wanted to pick that one up, but um, there's like too many... Too many fighting games I want to try out, you know what I mean? So I kind of got to pick and choose a little bit. I will say, Strive, it's its funny. Strive looks good, but they really did fuck up that UI. It's just... 
one of the coolest things about Guilty Gear is how over the top it is. And then they were like, we're going to have it look like a fucking iPhone. An iPhone app, a mobile game. There we go. Hey, it's Breakthrough's Defense. Also, those, uh, those... Oh, wow. Those fucking combo numbers be taking up the whole fucking screen is uh, a little bit ridiculous. Once again, I, I like dabble in fighting games, so I'm like trash at them. I want to get into them more, and I, I plan on doing it a lot more on this channel. Just, uh, you know, when you get bodied repeatedly, <laughs> it's a little disheartening, especially on stream, because I feel like when you're streaming a fighting game, people kind of expect you to be MLG Pro. So when you're uh, getting... getting bodied for like a decade holy shit and i feel like people are poking in like wow you're bad <laughs> it's like no shit dude <laughs> i'm fucking aware i am aware i'm bad yeah like i like this uh this this mode this is cool so we, i just i had literally just cleared arcade mode but uh i like it i like it it's a good practice it's just crazy that the um the training mode they make those training mini, mini games extra, extra difficult. All right, let's let's try a quick match, and we'll uh, hop in. Hopefully, they don't drop any hard end bombs <laughs> just while I'm on stream. Like, just do that by default in case anyone's streaming. <laughs> just don't fucking fuck with them. Uh. Let's see, some dude says it's wild. I can play GG and Tekken perfectly fine, but play me in Street Fighter and I instantly turn... Yeah, Street Fighter I find a little bit... I don't know. Something something about it I find kind of tricky. Um, like, I played a little bit of Street Fighter 2 um, recently on stream, but uh, Street Fighter 5, uh, me and my friend picked up, and... Yeah, I don't know, man. I can't, I can't really explain why I don't like that one as much, the newer Street Fighters. I can appreciate the old ones, although they're, you know, obviously way, way broken with certain of their uh, elements to it. So what is, what is like, the appeal of Tekken? It's just, like, air juggling and shit, right? <laughs> is, that, is that the main idea? You know, it's 3D, space, air juggling, combos. And Tekken is the one with, like, King and shit, right? The guy with the fucking Jaguar head. And Heihachi. I hope I'm, I hope I'm thinking the right one. Well, uh, we'll wait for a second. I feel like this is fucking completely dead. I feel like this is completely fucking dead. I'd be very surprised if it wasn't. <laughs> rules. None. <laughs> no rules. Please, get me banned on Twitch, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. We'll do, we'll do like a ooh woo. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, 3D space juggling and ridiculous combos. I gotcha. Yeah, I um, I've wanted to play uh, you know, just stick around with Tekken 3 because it's like I see it a lot on top PS1 games of all time. I know like, yeah, I go back a lot to old games. If you haven't fucking noticed, uh, I, I just I just like to go back to older games even if it doesn't quite make sense just to kind of rediscover shit I missed. But, um, yeah, I guess we'll do some CPU. Do I choose a CPU, or what? Hey, look at that shit! I mean, you know, I, I should be dead. <laughs> I fucked up pretty hard there. Oh, you motherfucker. There we go. Um, also just got, uh, Kazuya and Smash, so that's hype too. I got you. It's funny how they've been adding, like, King of Fighters and shit to, uh, to, uh, Smash Bros. Um, I never really played too many of those, uh, SNK fighting games, you know what I mean? But, there we are. But, uh, as far as SNK fighting games, though, I did, I did dabble very bri- Wow, what a cunt. I did- <laughs> Oh, man. I did dabble very briefly with uh, Samurai Shodan. I thought that was pretty fun. Ooh. Wow. 
I'll say I feel like the um the CPU might be even better at getting you good at it because you know with the arcade mode they have names that tell you exactly what they're gonna do, whereas this just doesn't. You don't know what the fuck they're gonna do. You gotta read them. Hey, there we go. <laughs> you fucking asshole. Uh, just psyching me the fuck out. Holy shit. Oh. There we go. How about that? How about that, motherfucker? Uh, people usually rate Tekken 3 as one of the best in the series. Best in the series. Oh. There we go. Holy shit. Um, same played like one King of Fighters game. Want to try Samurai Showdown though? Yeah, I um I've looked at a list of best um Turbo Graphics 16 CD games. I always thought it was like a very impressive console, but one that like wow, what a dick that I never really got into. But uh, yeah, one one of the uh King of Fighters games is really big on that. You ever um if you've never heard of Turbo Graphics or uh, PC Engine as it's known in, like other parts of the world. It's like this really weird anomaly of a system. It was like the first disk-based system, but also... I, I don't even know what the fuck I did there. <laughs> I did something there. Something impressive. <laughs> Shit. But, um, what, it was like the first 16-bit system as well, but it kind of like half-cheated, because the uh, CPU was actually 8-bit, but the, the graphics card internally was 16-bit. So it got a lot of, um... A lot of like arcade style games, but once they introduced like a six button controller much later on, that's when you got a whole bunch of those SNK fighting games. Yeah, this is, this is a pretty cool game. Like, it's very basic. Like, very fucking, you know, no shit. You know, if you want a game that you're gonna dump like 20 plus hours into, uh, this sure shit ain't it, but. Very fucking novel concept. Oh. <laughs> You fuck! Ah, oh, just psyching me the fuck out. Oh man, mind games. Wow, got fucking bodied. Let me do one more. <laughs> yeah, it's it's something very satisfying about this game, even though it's. There we are. Even though it is simple, but I mean. Teaches you the general idea. You know, when there's only one attack button and no jump, uh, you know, you do rely a lot more on that block than you would otherwise. Which is fucking key. Block and spacing. And I mean, that's the whole point of the game, is to teach you that shit. There we go, hey! It's actually looking kind of impressive. Uh, definitely impressive console for the time. Yeah, yeah, no, the uh, the name sucks. Both, I think both names, I'll say. I think PC Engine sounds a little cooler. But um, the PC Engine, the form factor was really cool, but the Turbo Graphics was... Uh, I actually looked into the reason why the Turbo Graphics 16 was this obnoxious, oblongated thing. And it was something to do with some weird law that was like... Things that could be classified as a toy that use electricity can't, and like computers can't be that small. So they had to like waste a whole bunch of uh, space with it. And just have the small ass chip in a giant ass box. Which sucks. I thought, you know, that was like one of the coolest parts of the PC Engine was that it's just like this tiny little, little box. Almost like a shorter GameCube, you know what I mean? <laughs> you little motherfucker. You wee bastard. It's kind of like with the uh, Sega Saturn and shit, is I would love to, um, you know, collect some of this shit, but with the advent of, like, AGN, you know what I mean? You had, like, a million of these... You have a million of these... Uh, YouTube video game review channels where they have the wall of their video game collection in the background and they just do the review system where they, you know, talk about the fucking game and then they cut back to their face and they're like, you know. 
And in doing that, you have a whole bunch of assholes who are like, yo, I want to do that too. But in doing so, you have a million people who all want, like, this giant fucking retro video game collection. Which drives the prices so far up, man. That's why the Japanese imports of these are so much cheaper, you know? Man, I'm getting the, I'm getting the fucking hang of this here. Until, you know, I get fucking bodied by one-hit KO, that's nice. <laughs> Shit. There we are. That was very uh, generous with that uh, that block time. All right, uh, we're we're good here. Um, let's see. So that was that. I guess we could try survival, arcade survival. Yes, we'll try arcade survival. Let's see, some dude says, "I feel you." Honestly, I started getting back into retro game collecting, mainly PS1 stuff. PS1 is such a good console. I feel like it gets kind of people people talk shit on that generation specifically now because it looks. Ugly, relatively speaking, you know what I mean? But it's, uh... It's fucking great. I don't know, it's a great, um... Console. All the, uh, third-party jump ship to Sony. Damn, damn it, damn it, damn it. What's up, Nevi? How you doing? I beat the arcade mode, Nevi. Oh, wow. Uh, some dude says, hell, I looked at Metroid Fusion for the GBA online, some dipshit was selling it for 175 Man. That's great. I remember, I remember seeing, uh... There we are, got him. I remember watching, uh... I don't know, back when I had, like, Facebook years ago, but, like, Facebook is such a fucking shit show now. I mean, I guess it always was, but it's, like, even more so. Alright, if, if you're not gonna attack me, I'll just attack you, dude. Um... I remember, like, there was, like, ads towards the end there on the side. There we go. And, uh, one of the ads for locally, this dude was selling, like, Pokemon Red out of box, and they were trying to charge, like, a hundred bucks for it. It's, like, insane. It doesn't even make sense, dude. It really doesn't. People think, like, oh, all games, good. Shit. Hey, got him! <laughs> nice, that's a very, very satisfying move. Oh, wow. All right, all right. I see what you're doing, motherfucker. All right. Wow! Uh, uh. <laughs> Come on, you fucking piece of shit! Not even fair. Ah, uh, mm, I can't believe it. Uh. <laughs> oh, you cunt. Oh, uh, jeez. All right, new high score. Well, let's try a regular survival, then. This ain't bad. Shit. Shit, I fucking missed my window. I missed my window. Ah, Jesus. But yeah, people have, like, an old game, and they think, like, Oh, yeah, I can charge a fucking arm and leg for this. But, like, sometimes, sometimes, you know, if, if people are buying it for it, you know, you have to say, well, that, I guess that is the fucking price of it, if people are willing to buy it. It's like that uh, one copy of, like, in I mean, it's it was pristine, but, like, a pristine inbox copy of... Um, the original Super Mario Brothers for NES sold for like more than half a million recently. It was like something like that. Hey, there we go. Uh, retro Pokemon games pretty much require your firstborn in the small loan. Ah, oh, god, what a fucking dickhead. Okay, so I see what this is. It's like you go until you've been knocked down three times. Okay. I got it. Well, shit, let's try it again. All right, backstream sub. Just wanted to drop by and shit on my favorite piece of shit. Thank you, Nevi. I, I appreciate it. Well, I hope I hope you uh, like the way this game looks. I feel like this does not get like anyone fucking talking about aside from like um a few YouTube channels that just focus on fighting. So once again, it's just something I like dabble in. I just like watch the shit more than I actually play it. Because, yeah, it's just an intimidating genre, it takes time, but I want to use, like, I want to start to use my streams as a way to kind of motivate me to actually, like, try. Like, maybe take, like, one or two days of the week just to stream a fighting game. And just get better. Just get better that way. 
Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, once again, this kind of reminds me of, uh... There's a game called Kovac, um... I think the Kovac, uh, Tracker Trainer, just Kovac. Like, K-O-V-A-K. Or K-O-V-A-A-K, I should say. And it's just, like... It's a super stripped-down, uh... First-person, uh, shooter game, where you just, um... Yeah, there's like small moving targets, big moving targets, shit like that, and it's just kind of... Hey, there we are. You just, um, yeah, you just get better at the general motions of like, yeah, flick and shoot, you know? Wow. What a dick. There we are. Nice. This is cool. This is definitely cool. Um, online seems to be dead, but we'll, uh... We'll take our time later on. Just, you know, maybe like five minutes to wait in the lobby. I just don't want to spend, like, too long fucking about, you know what I mean? It's just a blank, empty online lobby, but, you know, we should at least give a, give a try to find some people who play this. Although, you know, there are Steam forums. I could always just throw up a uh, thing and be like, hey, let's do this. Also, for um, multiplayer nights on... Uh, for multiplayer nights on the Discord, uh, I should do another, like, straw poll. Wow! What a dick. It's a hell of a way to go out. But clearly we're getting better. Shit, look at that. Um... No, 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 no. What am I doing? No. Get out of here. Get out of here. Yes. What should we do? Well, we did arcade. I wonder how you, uh... Unlock more skins. You just keep playing through... Oh god, that's such- Oh god, my eyes. Yeah, we don't have this. Oh god, my eyes! <laughs> Some of these are fucking awful, man. I actually don't mind the uh, like the black, yellow and black, honestly. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> god, this this one's good. I like that one. Oof. Yeah, my poor eyes. We'll keep that one. Holy shit. Um, yeah, let's uh, let's try. We'll try a little bit of online, then we'll try another round of the arcade mode. I guess just to unlock more shit. I guess, you know, if you unlock a new palette. What about find lobby? Join JYS. Oh, that's depressing! Oh, that's so depressing. <laughs> Alright, we'll just create lobby. No, no, no. Um, just quick match. Same fucking thing. Um, shit, what I was saying. Yeah, so if you, like, play something like this. And, you know, just pick it up, put in the... How long did it take us to beat the arcade mode? Like, 11, 12 minutes? Just play this shit while you're, you know, waiting for your homies to join a uh, game night, or... You know, whatever. I mean, shit, it will it will teach you fundamentals. I already feel like I'm uh, a little bit better at spacing, a little bit better at using that block. Which is where I suck the most, I think, in fighting games in general, is blocking. I don't know. I don't know why. <laughs> like, why it's so foreign to me. I just block fucking everything. Uh, some dude says literal representation of Rev 2 servers on PS3. Yeah, I haven't fucked with online on um, Guilty Gear Rev 2, because I mean, intimidation, but <laughs> intimidation, you know, I'm like, I like just sticking around with it, but uh, you know, if I ever want to get bodied, um, I, I did look on Steam, and I do see a lot of people bitching about that, which... Yeah, it is a damn shame. And on uh, on the Discord, I was talking about um, Skullgirls. I, I did buy that recently. I think I I want to say that the online community is still going strong. Hopefully, because people seem to really dig that game, and I think they should be they should be playing that one. Um. Because from what I hear, one of the things that Skull Gir Girls does well, like, you know, it does a lot of things well, but one of the things it does very, very, very well is that, uh, 
however it does its netcode is very good in terms of keeping lag and ping as far down as possible. Good connections. Um, some dude says, I definitely do think this is a good game to start with to get the basic fundamentals down. Yeah, that's why I, I love, like I said, uh, that Kovac um, tracker trainer. I don't know what the fuck it's called. It's called Kovac. Um, similar price, similar idea of just enthusiast of the genre made a game just <laughs> for one single purpose and tried to keep price down. But, uh, see, some dude says, I gotta get Skullgirls, never try the first one. Y here's the thing is, it is the first one, right? Um, visually, looks pretty dope, visually, mechanically. Yeah, they, it is actually the first one. They just changed the title. Um, I, I don't know why, what it is with games and making shit confusing, but they do. So, from my understanding is, they had Skullgirls, and then they changed the name to Encore, when they, God, what was it? When they like split with Konami, because Konami was a bunch of dicks, and they had the rights initially publication, but then they, you know, stopped making games because they're fucking Konami. And then they wanted to like finagle their rights right over it, so they had to like buy the rights back, the company that made it from Konami as they left, and then. There was Encore 2, or Second Encore, is that what it's called? So Skullgirl's Second Encore is just, like, an updated... It's just it updated. It's just it updated. It's the same thing. I think so. Let me, uh, double check. I don't think I'm just making that up, but I might be. <laughs> you never fucking know. I could be pulling shit directly out of my asshole. Skullgirls. Yeah, I think, I think it's the same fucking game. Yeah, because you can't buy regular Encore anymore, I think. Um, maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Uh, let's see. Or, like, I think they, they pulled it down after the Indiegogo, and then... When they put it back up, they just made it second encore, the one thing available to buy. But it's essentially the same game, but it's kind of different. Oh god, it's 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 convoluted. It's convoluted as shit. I can't even like under <laughs> like I can barely understand it, you know. Uh, some dude says Konami can choke on a dick. Yeah, I saw second encore in my PS Vita a few years back. I thought it was an entirely new thing. Yes, I own a Vita too, actually. Vita, I've actually heard that Vita is one of those systems where no one fucking bought it, but the people who did have it actually got a lot of enjoyment out of it, and apparently if you crack the Vita and fuck with it, it's like an emulation beast, and you can like do all sorts of cool shit with it. And if, if you're into certain genres, like JRPGs or some shit, uh, you know, Vita t is good. For certain genres, you know? But honestly, like, the PlayStation Portable, like, the you know, the original PSP, dude, oh, it's so easy to crack, and you can just fit so many games onto that memory stick. It's insane. Dude, what a great fucking buy. Yeah, like, that's the thing is, you know, PSP, it had to go up against Nintendo, which has a vice grip on the handheld industry. All right, I, I don't think, <laughs> I don't think this is gonna happen. So uh, let's let's uh, go back to a arcade and we'll do this one more time and then uh, yeah we'll do this like again sometime just a couple arcade rounds of it and then uh, I think I'll hop back onto uh, Street Fighter 2 for the SNES Classic. Oh God! All right. Um, somebody says it's amazing. Honestly, hacked both of them. Like, yeah, it's so easy, right? It really is. There's actually a Dreamcast emulation. Um on it, but it's a work in progress. 20 <laughs> frames per second on Crazy Taxi. Yeah, I have a Raspberry Pi, and um, people say that you can emulate Dreamcast. It's like, you can. You can, in theory, but it's... Man. <laughs> it's like, would you want to when uh, there's that many performance issues? At, at a certain point, I'd rather just emulate on my PC for the, for the later shit. But I actually love my Raspberry Pi for emulating older shit. But uh, my PSP, man... Yeah, I still have that. Yeah, it's right on my desk. Probably <laughs> the batteries are dead, but it's, it's fucking good. Good time. Actually, my, um... 
I got for maybe like 20 bucks like an HDMI connection to my TV so I can stream PSP games. Just a couple, not much. Wow, what a dickhead. <laughs> yeah, but the question is, should you? <laughs> oh, wait, oh, wait, oh. Wow, what an asshole. All right. I gotta, like, get, get in the mindset here of, uh, poking and prodding. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that's the thing, is when you're playing the, um, the CPU in this game, it's a little bit of everything. I think it's actually a little bit easier than, uh, some of the shit. Oh, wait, shit. He's, he's dead. He's dead. He's broken. <laughs> shit. Cool. I gotta, I gotta remember that the shield mechanic is a thing, you know? Wow. Wow. Fucking blocker kicking my ass. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, it's kind of funny, though, with, uh... We kind of use the tactics of these guys on each other. Um, let's see. Somebody says, I actually did that with my Vita. There's a mod you can enable that lets you do USB capture. It's pretty dope. If you have a Raspberry Pi, you can dock it. Oh, okay, cool. Dock it to your TV with a custom Pi. Come on, please. Wow! <laughs> God, that sucks. <laughs> oh man, you little fucker. Oh come on, I need to confirm that shit. I I don't even know why I did that. Like he obviously is gonna block my special attack. His name is fucking Blocker. <laughs> when I hear Blocker, I think of Jay and Silent Bob. <laughs> that one scene where it's like, why do they call you Cock Knocker? Well, see, it's a funny story about that. <laughs> he just, like, fucking drops and uppercuts him in the dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. That's a fucking good scene. I gotta, I gotta get my fucking head in the game and out my ass. Fuck! Oh! <laughs> God! Fucking dick. Damn, that sucks. Uh, and I got poking prod blocker. I got a wow. Blocker just fucking sprinting towards me, going on the offensive. All right, all right. There we go. Okay, okay. I just gotta get my head in the game. Damn, he's gonna fucking punish the shit out of me. Yeah, I don't even understand how the raging demon thing works in this game. The, like, crazy-ass special. Shit. There we are. Okay. So I either gotta break his defense or just fucking uh, hit confirm. There we go. Okay. Okay. I guess it's easier just to break through his defenses slowly. Not not really a pretty way of doing it, but fuck it, it works. Alright, ordinary guy. <laughs> like the uh the do rag here. What was that fucking remind me of? I see like Killer Seven, that one kid. Dude with the dual pistols. I actually uh streamed Killer Seven for Halloween last year. It's like, that's a game that I always go back to, and, cause I'm like, never really sure how I feel about it. And it's always like, a seven out of 10 game. Like some serious problems with it, but like, it's got so much style, you can't help but kinda like it. <laughs> all right, all right, with Punisher, yes. All right, so don't fucking whiff. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's not. That's not what I want to do. Go. Go back to that. Killer Seven is a weird one. Yeah. That's the thing. Is like I always like think about it. I'm like, how do I feel about that game? And then I go back to it. I'm like, yeah. I'm still not sure. <laughs> like after I played it like the eighth time, I'm still not sure. I guess I fucking like it, but. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Dick. Uh, Jesus. How did I beat this guy last time? I don't even fucking remember, man. Shit. Well, not like that. Not like this. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> I gotta, I gotta, like, not just fucking... Like, look at his fucking name. Think about what he's gonna do. And then I just do it. I just fucking default to doing exactly what I'm doing. It's crazy. Come on. Oh, Jesus. My reaction time is balls. Oh, boy. All right, all right, all right. Jesus Christ. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just, just defense. Get get close and defend. Um, some dude says, I'd say if you want those really weird vibes, Silver Case is pretty good. But it's official novel. I've seen that one. That one's done by Su Suda51, the Silver Case. I, I could... I might be thinking of uh, something different, but... Jesus. Oh, God. You know, I um I did see that um No More Heroes was just released to Steam. 1 and 2. I, I did not like 2 at all. But 1 I really liked. 2, the levels were just so insanely long. And 1 already had pretty long levels. And I didn't even find the... Uh, I thought the boss fights were also more long. And less interesting. Whereas, like, in No More Heroes 1, you can actually just destroy the boss if you know what you're doing, which I think is rewarding for multiple playthroughs. Wow. <laughs> wow, how am I having so much trouble? Do they increase... Do they increase the difficulty when you play through this again? They fucking might. Because, you know, you, you get one unlock per clearing of the arcade mode. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it was his first game originally dropped on PS1. The Silver Case. Oh, God. Yeah, I think they might increase the fucking difficulty after you clear it once, which is uh, pretty fucked. Alright, Poke and Prod. Keep distance. Okay. Um, some dude says, yeah, in one, I remember absolutely melting the bosses. Yeah, with that, like, shadow dodge and shit, when you get good at it, it's, like, so fucking satisfying. It's so fucking satisfying. I, I had to have played that, like, end-to-end -end boss, where you fight that Irish dude. I must have fought that, like, multiple times, because I'm like, wow, this is a fucking great boss fight. It it's everything you learned, all in one, but it's hard. But if you know what you're doing, it's fair. I don't know, it's just fucking well done. That, that night, I replayed that game multiple times, legit, just to see that one fucking German guy with the mohawk. That was, like, one of my favorite fucking cutscenes, like, in any game ever. Like, oh, I'm about to lose the power control! Oh, God! I am getting fucking bodied by this asshole, holy shit! No, 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 don't, don't. Oh, <laughs> God damn it, fuck. Ah, oh, jeez. 
this. I'm like getting sweaty and shit. That's how you know. <laughs> That's how you know I'm getting upset. -y. Wow, I didn't even. I didn't even that time. That was like a fucking mistake. Come on, come on. There we are. All right, all right. We found a strategy. We found a strategy that works. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh god. All right, all right, all right, all right. Come on, come on. Ah! Come on, come on, fucker. Oh, god damn it! I'm like looking at that shield, I'm like, shit, <laughs> I can't block either. Oh man, how. Dude. Dude, they definitely increased the difficulty here. Either that or I was doing something last time and I just wasn't even fucking paying attention. Shit. That was my window. That was my window and I fucked it. That was my window and I fucked it. Uh, gotta head out. Been up from work since 2am. I got you, man. I also work night shift and it sucks. <laughs> it fucking sucks. I got you, man. Hope you have a good one, man. Appreciate you dropping in. There we go, okay, okay, okay. That's something. Oof. Come on. Okay, okay. Let's, let's just fucking clear through this asshole. Clear through this asshole. Get to the next guy. Come on. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh god. Again. Again. Sucks. Ah, oh, that sucks so much, cock. Come on, come on. I um. Oh, oof. I um. Mm, how's my reaction that bad? How's my reaction that bad? I had a fucking golden opportunity. Okay, okay. 
No, you special moves. Fuck you. Nice! Dude, f <laughs> that was a fucking long, long... Go, alright, I remember, I remember you. Come on. You're gonna be easy, you're gonna be easy this time. I know exactly what you do, bro. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna just burn through this fucker, make up for the lost time. Nice, there we go. One hit man, man. It's fucking block. It's fucking block. Oof. Oh my god. It's like fucking going back and forth real fucking quick. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I think they actually did increase the difficulty. Either that or I'm just playing worse, or it's like my imagination. Oh god. I had I had an opportunity. I had an opportunity and I just I just couldn't I just couldn't There we are, okay, that's one. That's two Oh you fucking whore. <laughs> you fucking slut. Alright. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. That's game. GG. 12 minutes. I guess we didn't even do that much worse last time. Eh. Um, attack, attack, forward, attack, attack. Okay, well, I still understand. Color palette 3. You can change color palette and options menu. Actually, I don't mind that. Honestly, it's a little... I, th I guess it's a little bit harsh. Let's try it, though. Yeah, I actually don't mind that. It kind of reminds me of, um... Ah, uh, what is that game company that makes a whole bunch of really good shit? They made Dusk. New Blood? New Blood? Yeah, reminds me of New Blood. Alright, um... Yeah, what can I say? Cool game. Definitely fucking hard. I, I think we'll do, like, one more stream of this. Just because it's... I think it's just good practice overall. But yeah, we'll keep this. Uh, we'll keep this at like an hour and a half. Uh, footsies, check it out. I hope my I hope my mouse wasn't there the whole time. I'm sure it was. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, um, yeah, footsies, not not bad at all. Well, I hope you all have a lovely, lovely time. Let me switch back to uh, Quentin Tarantino, our boy. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I hope you guys have a lovely, lovely day, and I'll see you next time. Peace out, guys.